This is Insider Medicine in 60 from Wales. Researchers from Swansea University are developing a new antibiotic, which may prove effective against the superbug MRSA. The antibiotic, named Ceratisin, is developed using maggot secretions from green bottle flies and could potentially be provided in injection, pill, or ointment form to treat 12 strains of MRSA, as well as E. coli and C. difficile. According to researchers, it takes about 20 maggots to make one drop of the antibiotic. From Toronto, researchers from the Hospital for Sick Children have discovered a genetic anomaly in those at high risk for developing cancer, which could lead to a blood test for detecting tumors early. In research involving families with a rare inherited disorder, scientists discovered that affected individuals had greater variation in their DNA than those that were unaffected. This variation implies a greater susceptibility to cancer. And finally, from London, according to research in the Journal of Neuroscience, researchers from the University of Western Ontario have discovered why some people become addicted to nicotine after just one cigarette, and others find their first smoke repulsive. By manipulating receptors in the brains of rats, researchers were able to control how pleasant the first exposure to nicotine was. This research may lead to pharmacological treatments for the prevention of nicotine addiction, as well as the treatment of nicotine withdrawal. For Insider Medicine in 60, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma.